This is Amazon Guardians of Eden by ADV Ripper Forever. Okay, so if your phone was vibrating, turn it off, please. No, 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 that's the wonderful technology going on by Access uh, Games here. Is there uh, a place I can buy the soundtrack? <laughs> they were really <laughs> ahead of the curve with technology. Amazon Guardians of Eden cometh. <laughs> this is uh, before games went to full motion video. They kind of, this is sort of Access's like, before games became awesome. Yeah. Um, these are the people, by the way, who made the Tex Murphy games, if you're interested. Oh, uh, yes, the Jones brothers. Right. No, Chris Jones, who plays Tex Murphy, is uh, the writer on it. Nice. And Bruce Ward, who plays no one, is the programmer on it. So you're saying this game is excellent. Oh, yeah. A muse that led to these future games. Yeah. When I was a kid, I, I'd look everywhere for, like, little Indiana Jones-style games, and I got this, and I felt a little... Well, you'll see. <laughs> It's more like a Bob Ross video game so far. Mm -hmm. well, so it's many very, pretty trees. It's fairly photorealistic, as you'll be seeing. Like, oh, the Tower in the Jungle, Chapter <laughs> 1. <laughs> An access cereal joint. Mm -hmm. mm. You're going to love this cereal adventure. Why what don't you check out this caper? <laughs> what do you say we start our video game off with a wall of text or two? Oh, mm. lovely. I'll mainline it for you. These two guys are the Roberts brothers. Alan on the left, Jason on the right. Yeah, the guy on the uh, right seems to like his job more. Yeah, the guy on the right also screams smiling douchebag to me, but whatever. Uh, they work for the same company. Alan's out in, like, the fields of the Amazon. Yeah, the guy on the right is like, DMV didn't tell me when I should smile for the license card picture. <laughs> and the guy on the left is stern and stubborn about everything. Mm-hmm. All right, we get it. Well, anyway, Jason is known to some as the all-American boy. Mm. Just maybe something I wouldn't want to be known as, but, you know, whatever. Yeah. Great prom picture otherwise, though. Oh, yeah, totally. So can you recap that uh, that plot text? Wasn't paying too much attention. They are brothers. Okay. No, um, Alan, Alan's out in the Amazon, as we're going to say. Okay. At August 10th at 2 a.m. All right. Well, they keep weird hours. Now... In this scene, I remember it before it even comes up. I want you to watch Alan when we get into the tent, okay? okay? Which one's Alan? The, the, you'll see him, the beard, laying okay. down. Beard. He's laying down right now. Uh-oh. Oh, keep it down, guys. Oh, I thought well, they... Like he, like, he knew it was coming. <laughs> So, all right, six weeks later, we're well, That was the murder. What happened six <laughs> weeks later? <laughs> I think elevator music is the best follow-up to that. Oh, I, I hope you like that in this intro scene. There's a lot of it. Okay. So, Amazon's a very odd game. It, like, <laughs> yeah. I, it, you can see it's photorealistic, except the sprites are oh, kind pee, of gotta photo. Pee, gotta pee. They're kind of photorealistic, kind of drawn. Kinda? and Kind <laughs> Kinda. Kinda. Right, so we'll start our workday by taking a hanger, of course. Sure. And then... Is he wearing a bow tie? Yes, he is. Okay. He's the all-American boy, after all. Right, those are cool. All right, cool. And here's our lab. And we, before we show you, let's tell you what mm -hmm. the lab is like. The text makes me think someone is yelling this at me. <laughs> All right, so also the game can't decide if it wants to be first person or third person. Is this a science lab or a beat poetry coffee shop? <laughs> Music is confusing me. Let's take a rat to, you know, okay. take along with our coat hanger. What do you say? Sure. Yeah, why not? First Adventure instinct. Adventure games. Just grab everything if you can. Better take some science with me. Mm -hmm. Never know when you need science. I don't know what that rotating thing does. I don't think it actually does anything in the game. Well, it's but... a centrifuge. Oh, well, I'm glad we tested that it works. Oh, well, okay. And I think that's some ethyl alcohol we could get if we wanted. Okay. Perfect. Sweet. Well, the, the game just says alcohol, so... All right, Rat, you want to booze it up? <laughs> you want to party? Yeah. Did you hear that? Not a word. There's voice act. Oh, you, you weren't supposed to. It's very low quality voice acting is the thing. Hire a personal assistant who can, you know, articulate. Let's talk to her right now. Okay. Hi, Jason. <laughs> that is what the cue card says. 
So not everything is voice acted, unfortunately. Okay. <laughs> she did speak like the text was in all caps, so. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, our boss is angry, and, and typically these dialogue trees really do not matter. At least not in the beginning. Okay. But. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me, Darlene. Really put the oomph into the acting that out. So you can't see what the responses are next to each other? You have to click through? See them on oh, the okay. right there? Yeah. 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 It's not the world's easiest interface. But look, she always hated rats, so we have a clue if a puzzle should arise involving Darlene. If you need to get her out of the room? Yeah, ex which we clearly don't, but... What now? <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Photorealistic sprites and vocals. Oh yeah, it's totally. Um, I think you can actually die if uh, you say the wrong thing. To she her kills you. Well, you're at a government research, so uh, it's a government research facility, so it's easy to get arrested. And so all she that. takes her job very seriously. It will shiv you. Absolutely. So, anyway, we can try to pick up Darlene, but that's not going to work out. Why wouldn't we? Doing top secret stuff, should you leave all the science out there for anyone to come and steal? <laughs> the long player is doing a lot of the adventure game stuff kind of early, though, because right now we're just supposed to talk to our boss and that's it, but... Alright, what the hell, let's scare her, let's scare her. I was Darlene. hoping you would just throw it at her. No, I think it's just hovering out in space under the floor. <laughs> her rat sense tingled. So, now that we do that, we have the key open, we can take the key to our brother's laboratory. Why not just take all the keys? I don't know, if you want to know the truth. Okay. But... Getting oh. some Maniac Mansion vibes from this. Yeah, you should. We're only allowed to take two keys. I think one of them's a car key for outside. What's but... the Maniac Mansion soundtrack we're playing instead of this? Oh, you don't like this, uh, this uh, mellow tune? I did for a while. Up to a point. Alan's lab is like Alan! <laughs> uh... <laughs> It just saw its friend get shot with an arrow. Cure Ios. I am. All right, so oh, Alan's more science. More science oh, and I darts guess in case you get bored of the science. Alan's got a much bigger office than we do. He's because he's a much better scientist. Is the thing. <laughs> You know what they call the first-person adventure version of this game? What's that? Amazon Prime. Ooh. Does it cost as much? Who's with me? Yeah. <laughs> oh. I'm with you. Thank you. No, no problem. So, yeah. Um, I, 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 you're supposed to be knowing what you're doing by at this point in the game. I'm, but I'm glad the long player does. <laughs> yeah. I do because I've played through this, but... Did the Loyal. comedy mask and the tragedy mask fuck, and that's what, on the right, what came out? <laughs> Look, that's enough. We're taking, we're getting a blow dart and some darts, okay, to solve an upcoming puzzle, I suppose. Okay. What about the carrots taped to the, oh, wait, they disappeared. <laughs> and why the bow? <laughs> to go with our bow tie. This is for the dartboard, I think. Right. So anyway, look, we, uh, now that, <laughs> now let's, let's play a movie while we're Everything here. Everything's happening so fast, I'm just kind of going with the flow here. This is just like a, t a typical day in uh, in Jason's yeah, life. Yeah, just doing your job. Mm -hmm. There we go. How does this help your experiments? This is a movie called Wild Women of the Wongo. I didn't know the film filmed GIFs. <laughs> it does. Okay. This is, this is all they watched in the 30s. Oh, okay. The things like this. Like the, the actual movie reel is actually on a loop is the thing. All right, I guess we're just going to sit here and watch it. Just thinking about cool. which BuzzFeed list would this best go with. <laughs> See, now you're getting the actual 1930s film reel experience. Yeah, I sure am. All right, that's enough of that. Thank you. The projector stops running, but you really could have turned it off. <laughs> hey, don't forget to rewind <laughs> the tape. All right, so now that we've done all that, we can actually start to do a little progress in the game, possibly? All right, I can't wait to see what all this progress looks like. Oh. And you won't. Oh. So that's the whole game? Yep, that's yep. it. Okay. 
I learned a lot about work and science. Hey, me too. Amazon science, specifically. I told people this was not a bad idea for a Let's Play. Consider Eden guarded. <laughs>